Okay, our little side adventure to see about these caves totally has turned into Land of the Lost. <laughs> <laughs> totally. This, we're on a dirt. Good morning, everyone. It is Sunday, and we are getting ready to go to church. And then I think that we may do some, maybe some antiquing, maybe. A little drive, a little something. Something fun. Something, something fun. Every time we're together, it's, it's fun. fun. It is every single time. There's nothing that we do that's not fun. Yeah. <laughs> it isn't. <laughs> Blue skies and sunshine. All right. I cannot wait. Cannot wait to do something for this day. Got to do something at least outside. Yes, let's go. All right, running a little late this morning, so let's go, let's go, let's go. When all of a sudden I'm aware of these afflictions eclipsed by glory. All right, so in true Heath and Glenna fashion. Uh, oh, yeah, I guess I should put it in park. <laughs> hey! Hey, yo, yeah! I, I am parked. I just didn't put it in park. But anyway. We almost were in the UDF. Uh, well, no, I had a. I, we, if we would have. No, no. But anyway, in true Heath and Glenna fashion, uh, we have decided not to go antiquing because, well, Sun doesn't want to go with us right now, and that's fine. So we're going to do something different. I think we're going to go for a ride, but we're not sure if we want to eat or not yet. So we have to figure out where we're going to go first because. That's just how we do things. That's how we roll. We like doing this. We like just hitting the road and just seeing stuff and then stopping where we want to stop and exploring and, and all that kind of stuff. We just like doing that. I, we're, we're weird. old people. Yeah, we're weird and old people. What can I say? <laughs> she so loved being three that the thought of turning four, I evidently just put her over the edge. <laughs> okay, so we're in Hillsboro, Ohio. Watch the ice. Yeah, ice and water. Um, Hillsboro, Ohio is one of those kind of places where um, Sunday stuff's closed. So uh, we're going to go to Wanda's Grill, at least we hope, because yes, they take Visa and MasterCard. Woohoo! Woo we have no idea. We saw it on um, Yelp, so we're going to check it out. All right, this is cool. I've never seen this before. On the glasses here, they have advertising. That's actually kind of ingenious if you think about it. All right, Turkey Club, and my wife got some. That looks like a home-style breakfast. Yep. Those are chunks of potatoes yes, they and are. fries and eggs and bacon. They are. Looks good and smells good. Let's check it out. All right, so done eating at Wanda's. Nice little place, a little bit older, but still pretty cool. I like these kind of places like that, these Americana things that you don't get a chance to really experience. And that's the great thing about where we live at is you can go not real far and you're out in the country. So, pretty cool. We're heading back on the road to see where it takes us for the rest of the day. See those mountains and stuff? Well, actually, they're not necessarily mountains. They're the foothills of the Appalachians. So, all that area right there. All right. So, as part of our adventure, we just took a little detour. Uh, Seventh Caves and Nature Preserve, so we might take Jay here, so I want to take a look at it. And we are on, yeah, this is somebody's a road. driveway. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> I got it. You miss totally missed that. I don't know how I'm going to show you that, but maybe on the way back. If we make it back. Yeah, if we make it back. <laughs> this is the kind of adventure you can see from us all the time. Look at this. Magic Water Theater. I have no idea what that is. This may have been a mistake. You think? No. This is typical Glenna and Heath adventures. If I hear banjo music start playing, <laughs> I'm going to get concerned. <laughs> okay, our little side adventure to see about these caves 
totally has turned into land of the lost. <laughs> <laughs> totally. This we're on a dirt road and there is nothing but Appalachian stuff all around us. It's seriously. Okay. <laughs> it is seriously. I am expecting some kind of time warp thing to have happened here. So <laughs> all right, seriously, man. I really don't know where we are at, but this looks kind of cool. So, um, can't. Pretty far down. I hear rushing water. Here's some other kind of stuff. And there's all this stuff over here. I mean, it's a. There's water and everything going on down there. So, seriously, I don't know really where we're at, but it looks kind of cool. And I need to, I guess, figure something out before I get arrested or shot. All right, so we are back in civilization again. Thank goodness. It is astounding to me that a mile that way is like... Deliverance. Deliverance. <laughs> All right, so... Where we're at right now, this is actually some Amish country, and this is a um, Amish general store. Of course, they're oh, closed. We should check out the chairs. You want to check out the chairs? Yeah, I'd be curious to see how much they cost. Okay, we're going to check out the chairs, see how much they cost. But this part of Ohio does have um, a pretty decent sized Amish community. Uh, the further uh, north that you go, around Columbus, um, east of Columbus. They have a very large Amish community up there. So, um, no electricity, you know, pigs, cows, farms, sheep, all right here. And uh, it's actually kind of cool in a non-tech, no internet kind of way. All right, so I talked about the Amish, there you go. Right there, horse and buggy. This right here is Sinking Springs, Ohio. You can tell by the stop sign. And as soon as we go through the stop sign, we will be out of Sinking Springs, Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we had an interesting day. The day did not, the day took a weird turn, but not for a bad way, but just how life can be sometimes. You can be going down one path and then take a turn and end up somewhere totally unexpected so had a lot of fun today i think my wife had some fun as well in spite of herself just kidding <laughs> oh we've been married for almost 20 how many years 23 yeah yeah almost 23 years now so <laughs> yeah i don't know how old i am i don't know how long we've been married i'm an excellent husband I'm a very good driver as well. Yeah, well, that part not so much, but that husband, yes. Thanks for watching. I'll see everyone later. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Thanks. Bye.